A Colorado State Trooper trying to make an arrest shot and killed a man this afternoon. He was working undercover in Denver at the time. The trooper is a veteran of the force. His name is not being released. Nine News reporter Whitney Wild joins us from the hotel at 48th and Bannock where this happened. Kyle, we are also not learning the name of the suspect tonight, but police do say it all happened uh, right here, right outside the Ramada Plaza. As, I, as you said before, it was an arrest that went bad, and police say it was one fatal mistake that cost a man his life. Sky 9 captured the moments after a Colorado State Trooper shot and killed a man outside of a Ramada Plaza in Denver. Police say the trooper was working as an undercover officer on an auto theft case when he attempted to apprehend a suspect. That suspect fled on foot. The trooper pursued. Seconds later, the suspect pulled out a handgun. It was enough to force the trooper to open fire. He produced a weapon. Officer fired at that time, striking him. Uh, the suspect was transported to the hospital where he was later pronounced dead. The auto theft is a Colorado State Patrol case, but the moment the trooper fired his weapon, the incident became Denver Police's jurisdiction. They are now investigating the shooting. According to the Denver DA's office, there have been at least five other investigations into officer involved shootings this year. Most recently, another auto theft suspect was shot and killed outside of a funeral home. Friday, the Denver DA cleared the officers in that shooting. We have learned that the trooper involved in this shooting is okay, but he's on administrative leave pending the investigation, Kyle. Whitney Wild reporting in Denver. Thanks, Whitney.